yes as you can see on the screen this is breaking news Nepal criminalizes Christian conversion and evangelism and as we can see that the doors of evangelism around the world are being closed yes um, prior to this Russia has closed their doors on evangelism China India and now Nepal you have Saudi Arabia and most of the Middle East or the Middle East countries have closed their door on evangelism and um, this is the evidence that we are now we are living in the last days the countries around the world have used past laws so the doors of evangelism worldwide are being closed by laws you know, laws in Nepal you can go to jail for five years just for preaching the gospel or sharing the gospel in Nepal and you have to understand this that Christianity has been spreading very rapidly in Nepal it's, it's growing even though 80% of the country is Hindu Christianity is growing very rapid people are receiving the gospel this tells me that the gospel is the most powerful weapon on the earth these countries in the east they are afraid of the gospel and so they begin to close the doors of evangelism and you can see almost the, the entire east right now have closed their door on the gospel so the doors of evangelism worldwide have been closed by laws not only laws the doors of evangelism are being closed by disease diseases yes diseases right now is ravishing um, ravaging Africa um, we see the black death in Mozambique the bubonic plague it is a major outbreak in Africa right now bubonic plague because of this outbreak we can't go there to preach the gospel not only in Madagascar and Uganda and um, and so many of these African countries there's a major outbreak of the bubonic plague and it's at at the most dangerous level the pneumonic level where it can be spread through the air um, the doors of evangelism are being closed by disease and by laws and it's happening as we speak God gave a revelation in 2014 of worldwide vision day and it's a was a revel it's a revelation from God to the body of Christ to rise up to preach the gospel on one day for one hour with one voice with one accord every the first Saturday of every quarter worldwide where the entire body of Christ is it would it's the first in modern history the body of Christ will be seen preaching the gospel on one accord some churches responded some did not but now we see why God called for the body of Christ to go out into the all the world to preach this gospel because God knows that they will be closing the doors to the gospel and we are seeing it happening worldwide we want to entreat you we had Worldwide Vision Day for the past three and a half years and the Lord has led us into another three and a half years starting January 2018 right back to 2021 daily we will be in daily revival we want to encourage the body of Christ the doors of evangelism are closing and we can see they are closing to the preaching of the gospel and we gotta make haste we don't have all the time in the world we gotta make haste because this is the end time another country Nepal criminalizes Christian conversion and evangelism and we see this on the rise we gotta make haste to spread the gospel across the globe join us January 6 2018 for world wide vision day across the globe whatever country you are this is a time to rise up
Come out of the four walls of the building. Get on the street, go preach the gospel. Because the laws are coming. The disease are coming. And many more other um, factors that will contribute or reduce the preaching of the gospel. Make haste and go spread this gospel worldwide. Thank you for joining me for End Time Alert. Stay abreast as we continue to update you on these major things that are happening worldwide. Tonight, we'll be in our God's Revival World Conference. Join us as we continue to update you as God continues to move. God bless you. Yeah, Nepal criminalizes Christian conversion and evangelism. This is the end time, folks.